Good morning, welcome, welcome to my balcony in Pompeii, Italy. We are heading to Sorrento today. I can actually see it just over the water there. We have been in Pompeii the last couple of days going up Mount Vesuvius and visiting the ruins here. You can check that video out, video out down below. But like I say, today we're heading over to Sorrento and it is really, really easy to get from Pompeii to Sorrento. You just hop on a train, it's a local train, the Circumvestuvia. It goes all the way from Naples, which we actually got it from Naples to Pompeii a few days ago. And then we're going to get on it here and go to Sorrento, but it does go all the way from Naples through to Sorrento. I'm pretty excited to head to Sorrento, so let's go. We have arrived a little bit too early to check into our hotel. It's about 20 past 12, so we're going to go and grab a drink somewhere. We think, we think this is the main square. We've had a lovely lunch, lovely little relax in the sun. It was really nice actually. We're now going to go and check in to the hotel. Here's our hotel. How cute does that look? We checked in. That was nice and simple. 505 top floor. I'm not going to like the balcony. I think we've got a balcony. I don't even know. We might, not, we might not even have a balcony. I can't remember. You're carrying the key when we go out. <laughs> There's oh, no. Whoa. It says you've got the key. 505. It's cold. That's a good thing. Oh, yes. Oh, it is. That, that's nice after Pompeii, right? Yeah. Having an aircon that works. <laughs> Room tour. We have a bathroom. Unfortunately, it doesn't have a bath. Stephen's quite been enjoying baths while it's been on holiday, but no bath, but it'll be alright. And then through here, there's a slight little door here that you can slide. It's so nice that the aircon is working properly. Our aircon in Pompeii didn't really work very well. And then this is our room. Three single beds. My sister Lara is joining us in a day or two, so she will be taking one of the beds and just in the distance there you can see Mount Vesuvius if you saw our Pompeii Vesuvius vlogs we went up there yesterday I'm going to check out our roof terrace just go around to the edge whoa slipped down there it's lovely up here is that our pool? That's our pool. Oh, we're in Back down. 
So I've left Stephen at the hotel for a little bit and I've just come for a little mooch about like to get a feel of where I am and sort of what the place is like. So far, amazing, fantastic first impressions, fantastic first impressions of Sorrento. It has, seems to have anyway, like one just main pedestrianised kind of street through the centre. It's nice, I'm gonna just have a wander down that street again, maybe go down to where the beach area is and just get my bearings a little bit with the place. through all the little tight streets honestly the charm of Italy in general to be honest not just Sorrento but Italy in general I don't know how you just can't fall in love with the place but honestly once you come away from that main street that I was saying that it does seem to be the case that there is just this one main street once you get into all the like the windy bits it's actually really quite quiet like there's no one around at all found my way down to the beaches and to the port. It's a long way. <laughs> as soon as I was down at the port I thought I'd have a little look for boat tours. There's lots of different boat tours that you can do. You can go to Capri, Ischia, Positano, Amalfi, loads. So just having a little look at prices and things of those. hours later because I went back to the hotel and fell asleep. I was tired. We're now out. It is, I don't know what time it is, seven-ish. We're coming out for some tea. And another little wonder. It's 31 degrees. Sorrentina. Stephen's got a good old spark ball that you had for lunch. You had it for lunch. <laughs> Thank 
Here's Sorrento's main square at night. The queues for places. Check out the queue for this place. See the guy that was sitting down before? So I have just taken some cash out and every single, there's loads of cash machines and I checked about five of them. They all charge about five euros to take out money, which is a bit pain, but such is life. I haven't been charged at all so far. Well, I've been in Italy, but just got charged then. We are heading back to the hotel. We bought a tub of ice cream. <laughs> We're going to go back to the hotel. We're going to have a relatively early night tonight. First impressions of Sorrento. I know what I was going to say, Stephen. What, is it, what are your first impressions? But I think I know what they are. Too, too English. <laughs> too English. Too English. Too touristy. Yeah, that's all you hear is English voices. We don't really like that. <laughs> Which I mean, I guess we should have known. That's what Sorrento was going to be like. As we were saying, first impressions. Um, I mean, Stephen didn't come out with me on the walk today, so he hasn't seen how beautiful it is. Um, but yeah, definitely very, like it's a beautiful place, it really is beautiful. Um, I, we knew before we came that it was a very touristy place, let's be real. But yeah, everyone is kind of English, really. <laughs> and we like a bit more, we shouldn't have come here really, if that's what we like, I, I understand that that's a stupid thing that I'm saying. But yeah. Everyone's English, really. Um, but beautiful, so beautiful. Um, I think we're going to have a nice week or so. We're going to Capri tomorrow. I've just been trying to organise how we're doing that and what we're going to do over there. But I'm going to end it here for today. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.